Hi, I'm Daniel Reed, Video Applications Engineer at Biamp. I'm here to show you an overview of Tessera Lux video partitions and AV block objects within Tessera software. Video partitions can be created for 1G or 10G networks. The type of video partition will determine if the Tessera Lux device will operate using its 1G copper or 10G fiber AVB network port. Both 1G, 10G, and audio partitions can exist within a single Tessera system. When a video partition is selected, the Video Objects toolbar will be accessible. Available I.O. blocks are AV input and AV output. Each AV block object represents a Tessera Lux IDH1 encoder or OH1 decoder. The AV input block can be initialized with auxiliary audio input functionality as a single stereo port or two line ports. The controls on the AV input block will impact all the coders listening to the stream from this device. The input tab of the AV input control dialog contains selections for input media resolution and frame rate, 7.1 PCM embedded audio signal present meters, and auxiliary audio controls. Test patterns enabled on the IDH1 encoder are delivered across the network to all listening decoders. The 2 network tab contains bandwidth configuration controls for the Tessera Lux IDH1 and bandwidth information of the current video stream. Video mute, embedded audio mute, and freeze controls are available. The AV output block can be initialized with auxiliary audio output functionality as a single stereo port or two line ports. The controls on the AV output will only affect outputs of this single OH1 decoder. The From Network tab shows the incoming stream format and has controls for video mute, embedded audio mute, and freeze. The Output tab has HDMI output format options, current resolution and frame rate display, stream transition behavior, fill color, and Tessera Lux OSD message timeout. Test patterns enabled on the AV output are generated within the OH1 and sent to the attached HDMI device. 7.1 PCM embedded audio signal present meters and auxiliary audio output controls are available. The AV router block can be initialized with user-defined input and output counts. Cross points can be individually enabled or entire rows can be toggled. AV combiner blocks allow a new audio stream to be combined with a video stream. The resulting HDMI video output will have a new embedded audio stream. The video partitions also feature control blocks, presets, and logic blocks. All functions shown to you can be added to presets. Presets may also contain blocks from both video and audio partitions. Video partitions have video transmit and video receive partition connectors. They can be initialized up to 32 streams each. It is important to note that video partition connectors are based on streams and not channels. The video partition connectors can be used to send and receive streams between both video and audio partitions. On audio partitions, there is video to audio RX for receiving audio streams from video partitions, and audio to video TX for sending audio streams to video partitions. The blocks can be initialized as mono, stereo, 5.1, or 7.1 upmix or downmix for individual channel processing. Use of these blocks requires an audio DSP in the Tessera AV system. You can find additional tutorials and tips and tricks about all our products, including Tessera Lux, at our online technical support knowledge base, support.biamp.com. Thanks for watching.